dental caries or cavities are basically a portion of the tooth that has got decayed. Okay, so the aim when we treat a tooth that is decayed is to remove the decay and the remaining tooth structure is very healthy. The remaining part of your tooth is healthy but you've lost a part of the tooth because it is decayed. So that part is now going to be replaced. That is our aim when we treat a tooth that has a cavity. So depending on how badly that tooth is decayed or how deep that cavity is, our treatment will vary. So if you have a tooth that has a tiny cavity, we've spotted it early, you've come to the dentist on time, we take that de decay out and the remaining tooth is nice and healthy and now we replace the lost part of the tooth with what is called a filling material. We have filling materials that are really good especially for milk teeth because they are tooth colored but they release a lot of fluoride into the tooth and keep the tooth really strong. Uh, if the cavity has gone unnoticed, which happens often because a small cavity may not hurt the child. So once the cavity gets deeper, the child will start getting uncomfortable because you'll have food getting stuck inside. Child might complain while chewing food. It might start hurting the child. In that situation, the kind of filling we, we do may, be, may vary because the cavity now is a little deeper. Also when cavities are really large and the tooth is destroyed, we might want to put a cap on top of the tooth which is called a crown. That holds that tooth structure intact so that when the child is chewing food, you don't have the filling chipping or the tooth itself chipping because the tooth has become so weak. Of course, if the cavity has gone undetected, it might get really deep and it will finally reach the nerve inside the tooth. That is the pulp of the tooth. That's when the tooth might get infected and the child might need, might need root canal treatment. Or if it is really in a bad state, the child might need an extraction and what we call a space maintainer.